Hi, and welcome to my new tutorial about Java and JDBC. And in this tutorial, I'll explain how to return all values from table in your database. I also created one more person called Maria Thumbs. So let's start coding in our select all method. And uh, what is a plan basically? Well, plan is uh, to create array list of person objects. And in every step of our while loop, to create a new person object and to assign some values from, of course, from result set to uh, variables inside of our person object, and finally to add that person object to list or array list of person objects. So let's start. Uh, first thing I want to create is a array list of person objects and it will be like persons and I'll say new array list person okay you will import array list from Java YouTube now let's create connection uh, variable and let's initialize that variable let's create statement variable And result set equal no. Okay. Now let's make try catch. And finally. Okay, let's open connection. by calling get connection method from connection configuration class and let's initialize statement by calling create statement from connection and let's assign some value to result set by saying statement execute query and let's pass our query here inside of this method and query will be very simple select all from first Okay, that's it. Now let's make our while loop and let's say result set while result set next. Now let's create a new person objects in every step of our uh, while loop. Okay, and let's uh, assign values to variables inside person instance uh, from result set set id result set get integer and name column will be id person dot set first name result set dot get string first name person dot set last name result set get string last name will be name of column and finally in the end of this while loop i will add my person instance in array list called persons by simply calling add method and let's pass that instance okay that's it and then finally block of our try catch structure i'm going to close statement result set and connection so let's create, uh, let's close results at first. It's not equal no. And I'll say result set, I'll close. And let's run this with try catch block. Let me copy this to make things faster. Okay, and here is going to be statement. Statement, statement, okay, and this is going to be connection, connection, and this will be connection, okay, and finally I'm going to return array list of person objects, okay, that's it. Now, 
uh, let's see how to return values, how to print. So I'll say I'll create a new list of person objects again, and name will be persons, and I'll assign values from select all by calling select all methods from PDI. Okay, and to uh, basically we have a list of person objects, so we'll have to iterate through that list by using, for example, for each loop. That's the best thing. So for each person in persons, I'll say system out print line like person dot get id plus and plus person dot get first name and double quotes and plus person dot get last name. Okay, that should be it. Now let's run this to see what happened. Okay, as you can see, it printed all values from our person table. So I hope this was clear. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.